So today's lesson is 3.2, Investigating Quadratic Functions in Standard Form, and that's on pages 163 to 179 in your text. Your curriculum outcome is to demonstrate understanding of quadratic functions of the form y equals ax squared plus bx plus c and of their graphs, including vertex, domain, and range, direction of opening, axis symmetry, and x and y intercepts. Your lesson objectives today are to learn what the standard form of a quadratic actually is, to learn how the variables a, b, and c affect the shape of a quadratic when in standard form, and to be able to find the direction of opening, axis of symmetry, coordinates of the vertex, maximum or minimum value, x and y intercepts, and domain and range of the function. So a quadratic function is written in standard form when it looks like ax squared plus bx plus c. And so today's assignment for you is to use graphing technology like the website www.desmos.com backslash calculator to discover what happens when the values of a, b, and c change. And like in 3.1, you'll want to keep some of the values the same while changing the others. So you don't always want to change the value of A and B at the same time. You want to keep A constant, change B a few times, see what happens, and then change C a few times, see what happens. And you need to be sure to try negative numbers and fractions as well as whole numbers. When you're done, take a look at example number one on pages 166 to 167 in your text, and then try the, the two your turns on page 168. And your assignment is on pages 174 to 179, uh, questions 1 to 6. So good luck and we'll see you in class.